In this video, we are going to walk through how to create an AutoCRAT template in Google Docs so that we can create AutoCRAT jobs for our data. So here we have our spreadsheet with all of our data in it, and we now need to create a Google Doc template like this example for our data to map to. So the very important piece in creating a template for AutoCRAT is to create your tags that correspond to your column headers so that your data can map correctly into your template. These headers also can line up to a Google form with your questions. So if you have a spreadsheet that connects to a Google form, they are going to be your questions. So we're going to start um, from scratch over here and make this template match. So this is a goal setting Google form, and we'd like to create progress reports to share with our students and their families. So we have academic and personal goals, and we need to create those tags that map to the correct column headers so that the data knows where to go and will insert into our templates. So you can have bullet lists, you can have tags next to each other, and you can insert tags into a table. So we are going to use tables for our goal reflection sections. And you can see we have first name and last name next to each other with a space in between. We are going to label our tags on the left and insert the tags on the right. To insert a tag, you'll need to use the um, caret arrows and you'll need to have two of them to bracket in your tag. And the tag will need to be identical to your column header. One of the ways that is a good way to make sure that the text is the exact same is to go back and forth between your spreadsheet and copy and paste your header and put it in between your caret arrows. So we're going back and forth, copy and pasting our headers into our tags so that they are the exact same text with the punctuation, capitalization, that is all the same so that our tags match up and are mapped exactly from the spreadsheet to our template. We can then go back through and change any formatting, so the font and size and any of that we can change and adjust, but now our tags are ready to go. They are exactly the same and we can um, again adjust how we want this to look and make it look nice for our template. So we're going to split this up. We have our academic goal section complete and now we need our personal goal section. So we're just going to um, add this in and then copy and paste the reflection section down at the bottom. So we've got this and all we'll need to do is adjust the uh, words academic and change them to personal because we've used the exact same questions in our Google form. And so we can change those out and then adjust any formatting as needed. So our tags again go in between double caret arrows. You can label your template, adjust formatting as you would like and make sure that the text inside your tags matches exactly to your column headers in your spreadsheet. And so we've got our template ready to go here and it will match exactly to our spreadsheet and we have a nice um, progress report ready to go for our students that will match with their goal reflection in the Google form that we shared with our students. So this will be able to be shared individually with each student and then with their families. So that is how you can create an example of a um, Google Doc template to use with an AutoCRAT job. Check out our video tutorial on how to create AutoCRAT jobs to use with the add-on.